Hi, welcome for RTL Online Training and Placement. We are going to start a supply chain management uh, course from 28th November 2022, 8.30 AM IST. And this is the link. And these are the numbers for contact. And this is our office address. This is going to be both training and placement. So we are going to provide the training around seven modules in supply chain management. After completion of this training, you will can apply as three plus or four plus experienced consultant and you will be able to get a calls and get the placement. And we are going to give the complete uh, functional setups, end to end uh, transactions we will be discussing. And also we'll be discussing how to prepare the resume interview point of view as well as the real time. Okay, so here I'll just give an introduction overview of the syllabus, what we are going to cover. We are going to talk about uh, the complete uh, product management, nothing but item management and material management. These two combination, we call it as uh, inventory module, which will combine product setups, nothing but item setups and material management, nothing but item management. And we'll have a procurement, self-service procurement, sourcing module, supplier portal, supplier qualification. All these five modules we are going to discuss. Including this, we'll also talk about procurement contracts. Nowadays, the companies are asking for this procurement contract also. We'll be talking about this procurement contract. Okay. Then we will be having this uh, order management. In order management, we'll talk about DOO, distributed order orchestration process supply chain orchestration process, GOP. And we'll be talking about uh, the order entry and order pricing and uh, shipping. And we'll also talk about cost accounting. This we would like to introduce from this batch, the uh, costing, costing module also. Because nowadays the people are asking, do you have any idea about the costing also? Because in inventory, once we perform the transactions material and they are expecting the material cost different types of uh, costing methods they are expecting. So we are going to cover that also and accounting transactions, procure to pay cycle, order to cash cycle. Even though we don't require in depth of financials, but still we need to have some idea about the payables and receivables, how the P2P or O2C cycle will work uh, that we need because in the interviews they will ask us. And also we need accounting entries, so which will be populated whenever uh, we are going to have the uh, transactions uh, like a procurement and payables, same thing order to cash, we will find. During this functional, we'll also talk about the approvals, BPM, data migration and BI reports, OTBI reports. We'll also talk about security console, how we can create the roles, how to customize the roles, how we can go for uh, provide the data access, uh, this all will be talking workflow notifications and value sets flex fields. Even though it comes under technical, it is required for functional consultant because when we are interacting with the uh, when when we are interacting with the clients, they will be asking us to prepare some functional specification documents for report and data migrations. This all. So we will be talking about those uh, all technical modules also. So it's a combination of uh, both technical and as well as functional, but it is 100% functional. It's end-to-end -end setups we'll be talking and the configurations and uh, having the knowledge of technical, 50% of technical we'll be discussing here. We don't require any prerequisitions for this. If you are already graduation completed at least two, three years back minimum, because freshers, it will be difficult uh, to get the requirements very few cases out of 100 uh, openings, there will be a five to six openings for freshers. But 90% of the openings comes with three plus and four plus and five plus like that. So after this training, you will be able to apply as four plus and uh, five plus will be able to perform that over here it is. Okay, so if you are a graduation MCA or BTEC or MCOM or MBA or any MTEC, any graduation having more than three years of uh, completion before, it means uh, 2019, 18, 17, 
even 2013 also we can go ahead with uh, this one so the people are eligible we don't need any prerequisitions for this because it's a cloud erp i'm going to explain right from the scratch please subscribe for my channel to get the latest uh, videos and job openings and all this here okay thank you let's see you on demo sessions we are going to have three demo sessions one is on 28 uh, 29 and 30 from december 1st we are going to have the regular classes regular classes will be there on this okay thank you